finest explorer I ever met. Preston Whitmore. Pleasure to meet you, Milo. Join me in a little yoga? Uh, no, no, thank you. Did you really know my grandfather? Oh, yeah. Middle fattiest back in Georgetown. Class of 66. We stayed close friends till the end of his days. He dragged me along on some of his dang fool expeditions. That's as crazy as a fruit fat he was. I spoke of you often. Funny, he, he never mentioned you. Oh, he wouldn't. He knew how much like my privacy. Ah, I keep a low profile. Mr. Whitmore, should I be wondering why I'm here? Look on that table. Ah, it's for you. It's from, from my grandfather. He brought that package to me years ago. He said if anything would have happened to him, I should give it to you when you were ready. Whatever that means. It can't be. It's the Shepherd's Journal. How convenient. Enter Omniscient Monkey right on cue. Well, you know what they say. When the student is ready, the teacher appears. That's it. No more fortune cookies for you. Whitmore, this journal is the key to finding the lost continent of Atlantis. Atlantis! <laughs> it wasn't born yesterday, so... No, no, no. Look, look, at, look at this. Coordinates, clues, it's all right here. Yeah, it looks like gibberish to me. That's because it's been written in a, in a dialect that no longer exists. Oh, no, it's useless. No, no, just difficult. I spent my whole life studying dead languages. It's not gibberish to me. Ah, it's probably a fake. Mr. Whitmore, my grandfather would have known if this were a fake. I would know. I will stake everything I own, everything that I believe in, that this is the genuine Shepherd's Journal. All right, all right. So what do you want to do with it? Well, I'll, I'll, I'll get funding. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll the museum. I'll never believe you. I'll show them. I will make them believe. Like you did today. Yes. Well, you know. How did you forget about them? Okay, never mind. I will find Atlantis on my own. I mean, if I have to rent a rowboat. Congratulations, Milo. This is exactly what I wanted to hear. But forget the rowboat, son. We'll travel in style. It's all been arranged. The whole ball of wax. Why? For years, your granddad bent my ear with stories about that old book. I didn't buy it for a minute. So finally, I got fed up and I made a bet with the old coot. I said, Thatch, if you ever actually find that so-called journal, not only will I finance the expedition, but I'll kiss you full on the mouth. Imagine my embarrassment when he found the darn thing. Now, I know your grandfather's gone, Milo. God rest his soul. But Preston Whitmore is a man who keeps his word. You hear that, Thatch? I'm going to the afterlife with a clear conscience, by thunder! Uh... <sighs> your grandpa was a great man. You probably don't realize how great. Those buffoons at the museum. Dragged him down, made a laughing stock of him. He died a broken man. If I could bring back just one shred of proof, that'd be enough for me. Oh, Thatch. <laughs> <laughs>